Hi guys, so this video is a little collective haul of things I've gotten in the mail and a little bit of shopping I've done. Christmas is just right around the corner and you can see I kind of bought a little bit of Christmas for myself. And now I really don't know what I want for Christmas because I kind of have everything I want. So I don't know, maybe I'll ask for some boots or something. <laughs> and I'm going to start off with these ColourPop highlighters I've been wearing all week. I really, really love them. Um, this one right here is Smoke and Whistles. And the texture of these remind me of the Becca Shimmering, um, Beach Tint Shimmering Souffles. They're kind of spongy and a little wet. They dry to a powder. God, these are just so gorgeous. Look how beautiful that is. That's smoke and whistles. And you know, I got a flash this for you, but yeah. Kind of has a wettish feel to it. Look how beautiful that is. That's beautiful, guys. Look how gorgeous. That's a highlighter you cannot deny. I'm not big on cream highlighters, but these are more creamish. Um, they just more like they dry to a powder I guess but they you have to use them more like a cream highlighter I suggest you apply with your fingers and then get a beauty blender and kind of blend it out when you get it on your cheeks brushes don't really work with these that well in my experience so I'm just going to be honest with you but Smoke and Whistles is one of my favorite ones out of these so I'm get that one right back on there these are really pretty. And you can't beat it. They're only $8 a piece. Um, really, really gorgeous. This right here is Hippo. This is definitely another one of my favorites. I've been trading between uh, Hippo and Smoke and Whistles all week. This is a Tell Lilac color. It's so beautiful. Words just cannot describe how beautiful this highlighter is. That is gorgeous. gorgeous. I get a little bit more of a pigmented swatch. There we go. Right there on top. It's so beautiful, guys. It's um, yeah, it's like a pale lilac, and it has like these rainbow shimmers in it. So gorgeous, just blows my mind how gorgeous it is. Look how beautiful. I really rec recommend these highlighters. If you haven't tried ColourPop highlighters and you're a highlighter junkie like me, do it. Go online, Google swatches like I did. You, you can't go wrong. These are beautiful. And this right here is Monster. I'm going to be honest, I don't know quite how to use this one yet because it's more of a duochrome. It looks white, but it has a duochrome pink. It, okay, I'm going to flush this. It's really pretty, too. Yeah. Right there on the top. It has more of a pink undertone to it. It's not like a highlighter or a highlighter like the two bottom ones. I'm thinking maybe I could kind of use it as a blush topper or something. I'm still still experimenting with that one, so. But it's it's beautiful. It's, it's definitely gorgeous. Check out the dual carmet nut free. I mean, even the cell phone picks that up. That's how gorgeous these are. You just whoever made these they're they're awesome. I mean they just they hit it. They hit it, man. All right, and this, <laughs> this, zero one, for sculpting zero, YouTube. I saw this on YouTube. I had to have it. I couldn't. I've swatched it before. I haven't really paid attention to it because it has a um a bronzer in it. I haven't really paid attention to it before because I don't really do bronzer. I can open it up. 
There we go. I don't really do bronzer. I'm a highlighter girl. But, okay. Look at that highlighter on top. Look how beautiful that is. Now, I'm going to tell you, I'm probably going to use this highlighter until I'm blue in the face. <laughs> how beautiful that is. Wow. That's just... I bet this would be a beautiful um, eyeshadow, too. Look at that. Bam. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous highlighter. One of the most beautiful highlighters I've ever come across in my makeup lifetime. It's so beautiful. It's white, but it has these these pinkish, bluish, rainbow shimmers in it. It's just, it's so multi-dimensional. I can't even explain it. It's just, it's so beautiful. I swatched it before and I was gone. I, I just, I ran right up to the checkout and paid for it. I was like, this is mine. This is mine. I'm taking it home. But if you don't have this highlighter, totally, just check it out. Go swatch it before. Especially if you're pale skin. They also have one that's like a dupe for Estee Lauder Heat Wave, which is like, um, it's a golden one, and that one's beautiful too. So if you couldn't get your hands on Heat Wave, check out Zero Two in their Pro Sculpting Duo. My Makeup Forever. There, it's gorgeous. It's really gorgeous. All right, so I got another um, Becca Shimmering Beach Tint. I got, it, got this in the mail, ordered it off Sephora. Because I had to get um, some more of my Stila foundation that I really love that I mixed with the Lancome one. So I bought this too because I'm a makeup makeup at it. And this is the Shimmer Souffle and Watermelon Moonstone. And watch me struggle to open this. <laughs> I was just not having... I'm, usually I'm really good at opening stuff, so I don't know... Okay, here we go. I don't know what's going on in there. There we go. This is beautiful, guys. Now, I returned the Guava Moonstone because I didn't really like the color of it. And this is more my style. This is beautiful. And this feels like the color pops when you touch it. It's, oh, it's way more wet feeling. I stand corrected. It's uh, definitely way more wet feeling. Color pop doesn't feel that wet. But... Okay, that's, that's a messy, that's a messy, um, finger swatch there. Wow, this is very pigmented. Let's see here, see if I can clean that up a little bit. So, I don't want a messy swatch. I want to, look how pigmented that is. Now, it looks scary if you blend it out. It's a beautiful pinched cheek color. There you go. That's beautiful. Right there on the bottom. It's blended out. It's really pretty. I love these uh these beach tint souffles. It's just there's only two colors I'm really interested in, and I have them. And this is one of them, so. But yeah. I love how they mix the highlighter in with it. It's really nice. It's cool. I don't think I'm able to get these lids on these things today. Because I think I'm having an off day, guys. I don't think. Okay, maybe maybe it's the other way. Okay. There you go. <laughs> and something else I got was the Sephora palette. I got this last weekend. It's called Wonderful Dreams. And I love the packaging. It's so holidayish. I'm just like, I'm so into shimmer and sparkle all the time anyway. But when the holidays come around, it's just, I'm, I'm no good. I'm just no good. So, all right, this is, I knew this would probably be a little bit harder to open, especially if you're one-handed with a cell phone like me. So, you get these beautiful eyeshadows. And I want to swatch them for you. You see, shadows are the reason I bought this palette. Let's swatch these 
show you. Oh, these are gorgeous. Right there. That's beautiful. And this palette is only ten dollars. Ten dollars. That's why it came home with me. So let's watch Chantilly Lace. Uh, Toasted Almond and Pretty Sunrise for you just now. Those are beautiful. I'm not too fond of the way this packaging is. I'm not, I guess I'm not used to it or something, but it's going to take some getting used to. It's definitely hard to close it back up when uh, you only have one hand like I do right now. <laughs> so that's a pretty palette. Check it out. It's only $10. Okay, and I got this too. This is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette. Edit Palette. Has dim light in it, iridescent light, diffuse light, mood exposure, luminous flush, and luminous bronze light. I just look at this baby. I'm wearing a highlighter today. And I have to say, it's probably one of the prettiest highlighters I own. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous palette. I almost don't want to <laughs> rub these swatches off. They're so gorgeous. Alright, suck so swatches like on top. I love I love these hourglass powders. It's just this dim light. Look how look how it the luminosity. Let's get out of here. Iridescent light. It's the highlighter I'm wearing today. All right, let's see if this shows up. Right there on top. And there's mood light, luminous light, and bronze light. I'm trying to swatch these and keep the camera still. <laughs> All right, so it's probably not the best swatches in the world, but. This is a beautiful palette. I don't think it's worth $80. I mean, it's just, that's way too much. Um, I suggest get it during the sale that's going on right now, which is 20% off. That would probably justify a little bit more. But I wanted to tr have all these colors in one palette. It's great for travel. I mean, look look at it. Look, look at it shimmering. This is beautiful. I should have asked for this for Christmas, but I couldn't wait. I had to go ahead and have it, so, you know, I'm just, no patience. All right. And that's what I got today. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's probably going to be a disaster. Move these babies out of the way. This is the Too Faced Grand Palais palette. I guess that's how you say it. And it opens up like this. And you get a Better Than Sex Mascara, which I haven't tried. Um, a Peony Melted Lipstick, which I've wanted to try for a while. Uh, it won't come out. And then a Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I'm not a huge fan of that, but uh, I think if I powder my lids a little more, it might not crease as much, but okay. Let's see if we can get this open. This is where the magic starts. Look at that. It's gorgeous. Let's take this out. Uh, let's see. Come out. There we go. Look at that. Beautiful.
beautiful, beautiful eyeshadows. I mean, wow. You get blushes, a highlighter. It looks like Mary Luminizer when I look at it. And then a bronzer. But look at these eyeshadows. Wow. I just, I got it today. I'm going to swatch the most, the prettiest eyeshadows, like the reason I bought this. I'm going to swatch them for you. These are beautiful. Two face eyeshadows like these, like if you apply them with um, your finger, look at that. Wow, that's that's gorgeous. That's gorgeous. And that one. So beautiful. That is definitely a beautiful holiday palette. These are gorgeous. Let's watch that highlighter. Why not? <laughs> I don't know where I'm going to... Okay, this is the highlighter. It's a little, looks a little, a little more subtle than, uh, than highlighters I'm used to. But it's still pretty. It's very golden. More of a golden sheen to it, so... But you get, let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. You get 15 eyeshadows. You get two blushes, a highlighter, a bronzer, and you get three eyeshadows up here. And I'm going to swatch this one for you. This looks like a duochrome. Yeah. That's a duochrome. Beautiful. So. So, now that would make a pretty highlighter. That would make a beautiful highlighter. I don't know if it's intended to be one, but it's probably going to be used as a highlighter. So, well, there you go. I made a mess, and if you have any questions about any of these products, just let me know. I'll be glad to answer them for you. But I'm going to get off the phone now get off this video and hopefully I can restrain from doing any more makeup shopping for Christmas. <laughs> really do need some boots. Alright guys, I will see you later. Have a good weekend. Bye bye.